Hi guys, and welcome to a new episode of All Stuff Film. In the next episodes, I will talk to you about a few actors who inspired me while growing up. Well, I didn't actually grow up as much as you'll find out, but hey, they say it's never too late. So, following my favorite actor's childhood timeline, the first one will be... Jean-Claude Van Damme. Why him? Well, because for any kid growing up in the 90s in Europe, this dude was cool as... You can't say that. He was really, really cool. Sorry guys, I want to keep this show politically correct, so I can't swear. Fuck that! I hate politically correctness. So, this guy was cool as fuck! I mean, this dude could kick ass while dining out, flirt with multiple ladies at the same time, deliver breezy one-liners while bouncing coconuts up his abs, and dance. Let's not forget about his dancing skills. So, I've been watching his movies since before I had hair on my chest, you pervs. Uh, I mean, his martial arts skills were way ahead of its time, and his trademark 360 kick was... still is awesome. His most famous movies are Kickboxer, Universal Soldier, Time Cop, and Hard Target. And the last three were proper blockbusters back in the days with big budgets, awesome villains, and wacky writing. What I like about him is that he really shines in smaller, low-key roles like Lionheart or Nowhere to Run. And when it comes to his acting skills, he can really surprise you. Goodbye, my friend. <laughs> He even successfully attempted to play a dual role in Double Impact, which was awesome. There, he plays twin brothers, and they do pretty much what I used to do with my brother when we were growing up. Come on! Alex, he's your brother! Brother? Why? Because he looks like me? I'm gonna change that. Because I'm gonna fuck up his face. Frank! Yes, he also worked on a couple of shitty movies like uh, Derailed or The Order, but hey, you know what? We all did stuff we're not proud of. He was also one of the original fatality dispensers. I mean, just look at these awesome kids. He chops this guy in a... whatever the fuck that is, a, a wood chopping machine. He cooks the other one in an oven like a Thanksgiving turkey and then impairs him and he casually drops a grenade down this guy's balls trying to make an omelette. I mean, no wonder the guys from Midway wrote the Johnny Cage character with him in mind. Okay, cut. Cut. Cut! Okay, Jesus, okay, what? He also had a multi-angle repeat hit that was replicated in many, many movies. And had the flair for the dramatic, like no other action star. What I also find inspiring is that this guy battled cocaine and alcohol addiction and is trying to keep his bipolar disorder in check. Hey, I love you guys. Go to the gym, don't smoke, don't drink, and be healthy. He remarried the love of his life whom he divorced in the 90s during a drug-fueled midlife crisis and is still kicking butt in his 60s. I mean, I would just love to give Van Damme a big man hug. Ha! Yeah. Shut the fuck up just for being there for me when I was a small skinny kid being bullied back home in post-communist Romania. I mean, I might have been afraid walking the streets, but in front of my bathroom mirror, I was INVINCIBLE! <gasps> you wish. So, if you haven't already, start watching these old-school amazing action bonanzas, and you know what? They're all available on streaming platforms, and it will be money well spent, I guarantee you that. So Van Damme, from one deadly weapon to the other, Namaste. You guys better like the background. I had to sacrifice my whole DVD collection for this. <laughs> if you enjoyed this video and are curious to see the next ones, cock past the subscribe button now. Till then, keep pushing.